Right, well, Bill Kamar, Peter Grass, I'm a go have yet. Um, doing good Scott do it hat, but a nice day. Well, um, go lucky that a Wikipedia. I'm just within the day. Well, a real old Wikimedia. Okay. Um, so I'm here wearing two hats. My wife tells me I'm two faced as well, but uh, I've got two heads. One is uh, the editor, an, an editor who I started about eleven years ago. Um, on Wikipedia, and the other one then is as the um, Creolor, the manager of Wikimedia UK in Wales, uh, um, in Cymru. So um, I'm going to talk mostly about how we can become without boundaries in the sense that language is not necessary all the time, and that if you create some code, then very often we can plonk it on another Wikipedia. And hey presto, um, language will appear in that um, uh, chosen language, uh, Wikipedia language. So um, when I came onto the Welsh Wikipedia, first of all, um, 11 years ago, it was, uh, we had about 17,000 articles. All the um, info boxes were created by the users. So having seen then um, what was happening on the English Wikipedia, uh, through people like Doug here, who's counted as one of the best coders in the world. Um, I saw we are recreating a wheel and we are creating, recreating a very shabby wheel. So I grabbed hold of some of the uh, templates, placed them on the Welsh Wikipedia and translated them. And hey presto, we had a better looking info box. So since then, I've done about a thousand, well over a thousand uh, info boxes or templates on the Welsh Wikipedia so that we can become something more than just, um, you know, recreating the wheel all the time when wheels aren't needed on uh, things like Cartier Llysg, um, the Celtic uh, chariot of war didn't have uh, instant, uh, at the beginning, of course, wheels and we can do without them. So it's the coding here which um, will work on many languages. So that's me there, that's my front page. I was a poet in my ex-life, in my other life, uh, so I've got two poems there in Welsh about sharing and to the, to the people who do edit and give freely. Or llenor i'r darllenydd, I think, is the most important um, uh, line I've ever written because it's, it's from the creator to the heart of the other person listening, whereby writing and text becomes, doesn't have to exist. When a poet has a feeling in his heart, it goes to the other person's heart, hopefully recreating that feeling. And I think we're at a time that this is very ephemeral, um, very temporary stuff, thanks to people like Delith, uh, over there and her unit and other units, Megan and so on over here, who will be bringing a, a translation and taking us into something whereby books become fossilised, hopefully as quick as possible, I say. Um, I placed all my poems on the web uh, in 1996. Um, most probably, you could, well, you could, in a sense, call it a, an e-book, I suppose, by now. Unfortunately, we haven't many e-books in Welsh which are free. The uh, Coleg Cymraeg have some of them. So that tells you a little bit about myself and my uh, drive and my use of this platform called Wikipedia because it's already created rather than recreating something. I, I pinch a lot of stuff, code and so on, ideas, and uh, adapt them, morph them to my own little language. I hardly do any editing on the English Wikipedia. You've got better people than me to do that. There are so few of us on the Welsh Wikipedia. That's my home and nowhere else. So this is a little description about... Um, about myself. There's the Prime Minister of Wales and I'm talking to him there in 2012. I then met up with um, Leighton Andrews, the Minister for IT, 
You can see on the right, on the left there, a little bit of um, how many edits I've done manually by hand, 87,396. That's live, by the way. So code, the coding for that does not need to be done by hand and eye manually. It's, it's there automatically. And that's what we're going to look at briefly now in the next five or 10 minutes. So uh, from there, let me just move to another page, please. Um, you can put anything in your front pages, uh, make them different to the standardized, you know, little buttons saying how well you speak German or whatever. Um, so, uh, Kernweg, what is wrong about the co? Oops. Okay, so let's start with this page here. We've seen something similar to it in English. This was the first Wikidata-driven, partially-driven uh, info box. So, which, which I put on the Welsh Wikipedia uh, about two and a half years ago, something like three years ago. So this one is generated by the ordinary info box, which you've got here. Um, taxon, and then um, the Delaware 2 is invoked by Wikidata, gets value, and then you can uh, have the species. Um, and we also have uh, the IUCN generated automatically calling an image, depending how scarce, how rare that species is. So in this case, it's Seafrater, no need to worry. Uh, um, not scarce, plenty of them around. So um, over here, um, that is called up automatically. Whereas on the English Wikipedia, every time the red book, IUCL red book changes, they've got to change 50,000 articles by hand. But once you've uh, uploaded the new, every six months, the red book, hey presto, it goes through the Welsh Wikipedia. So because of the power of that, I realised, well, we need info boxes where the whole lot is called in from Wikidata, as long as we can regulate it. Damn, the Wikidata people are not here. They saw what was coming. We have a bolt on the Wikipedia, on the Welsh Wikipedia, which is unopenable from two directions. The bolt allows us to regulate um, nationality, a nation. And because the sources say that the Catalan, Catalonia is a nation, we would put um, that on the Welsh Wikipedia because the sources, time over time over time, say, yes, it is a nation. And therefore, we can control what's coming in from Wikidata, and that's really important. So um, from then on, we went to, um, we worked then with Delis, who's sitting in the back there, over there, and her unit in a, a, a joint work where Magnus, uh, at my request, bought some code, how to bring in images from preferred images from Wikidata onto Senator, the species um, dictionary in Welsh, run by a society called Senator and Cymdita Sepatrui. Um, and the website of, their website really, or the coding which bought that dictionary in, was by the Prusco Bangor, by Delith's um, unit, technology unit. So working together with Delith, we were able to bring in images and that's, that's the um, one you've just seen there, onto their third-party website. So rather than taking things from the National Library of Wales, 20,000 images, and putting them on commons, we shared what we have with others. So this society built their um, dictionary and illustrated it with 16, 15, 16, 17,000 images from commons. So it became an illustrated dictionary. And uh, what I um, typed there, the different 
j'aimerais, uh, sorry, genius, genus or family uh, to be seen, as well as links, each one as a link to a, a Wikipedia page in Welsh about that. So yeah, there were problems at times, there were no links there, there's still no links with some of them, but problems are challenges and we can change them and nothing is static and if there are mistakes, we can change them. And that's the beauty of it, isn't it? So working with others, we could bring in our wiki into the real life, if you like, and the other way around. So, Penryn, oh, let's, um, sorry, uh, well, you can see here with the bolt, what I mean really is the ability to put a Kernu there as Penryn is in the nation of Brit uh, um, <laughs> Brittany, um, Cornwall. Okay, and we also um, I, I, I say as well, it is a fact that um, there is a claim to Kernu by another country, so we've agreed, we've um, placed that down as well. But as you can see, everything here now is um, editable on Wikidata. So it's Wikidata driven other than this bit there. So all you've got to do to create that, and each one, every single article we have on the Welsh Wikipedia, which is geocoded, has a live map coming in from um, OpenStreetMap, Wiki, Wikimedia OpenStreetMap in Welsh. So on the English one, it would be just a, an image, uh, um, you know, a, a cropped image of it. So on the Welsh one, we can open and close and go into it and see uh, the Welsh language, the villages and so on in the Welsh language on it. So that's a step forward. Do tell me to shut up. I haven't got a watch. One minute. Oh, my beings. Right, I'll go to the most important thing. I, um, okay, we've done the same thing as well with people. So all of these are called in. We've also on the bottom there got a one line here, which is driven by Listeria. And you could populate that with 100 people on it. Most articles do have more than one. Okay, so that's another way of bringing Wikidata in it. Um, however, to cut things short, um, I've got one other here. Uh, the whole of that table comes in through digits, no language. Um, so the bit missing there is the um, GDP of the Basque country. They have the um, uh, pen, the uh, per head, but um, not they haven't yet got the nominal um, GDP. So that comes from this code here. And these info boxes are one liners. You put just one line of code and it generates. So you can copy that into all articles on your wiki and it'll generate it then. So this one is created in a different way. Um, we create a property. So there is a code for each one of those you saw in the table there. So the Basque one there, which isn't, um, populated because it's not on Wikidata is that one, which is this one here. So um, I'm going to finish with one thing, um, which uh, is a book my father wrote in 1967, which is out of print, has been since the 70s. It's that picture there. And this really is a, um, a novel about what we're talking about today. It's uh, about keeping uh, the rich diversity from being melted into a, a grayness of people. And this is the novel which Gwenna Saunders took up and created an album based on the science fiction called The Last Day, The Final Day. And in that book, there, is, uh, there are many ways of fighting to keep the rich diversity of this planet. And it is through a smaller languages, uh, which Big Brother cannot decipher, is the suggestion there that we can come together um, as the long tail, if you like, 
the long tail in the graph. Of course, you've got the major languages and then you've got the minority languages. But if we come together and discuss ways of consolidating our languages, then yes, we are equal, if not greater than the big languages who sometimes do bully us without, without attempting at times, trying to do so in other times, at other times. But the, the small wikis, the small people can come together and we can discuss these things as a group of diverse, different, the fringe people, if you like. Um, so get on your wiki and fight not with arms, but with Wikipedia. Yeah.